Starts off with a phenomenal ATO here by Nate McMillan and the Atlanta Hawks. I'll let you watch it one time, and then we'll go over a two-for-one. couple terms knocked out in the same clip. Always a great bonus when you can kill two birds with one stone, right? So, in this play, there was Kansas action and a hammer screen. You probably recognized at least one of those, but if you didn't, that's all right. We'll walk you through it anyway. First of all, as the ball swings, this right here is commonly known in NBA terminology as Kansas action. Not really super common action anymore, to be honest. Uh, something you probably only see on the occasional after timeout play. So not crucial by any means to your, your understanding. But if you want to improve your terminology a little bit, this is basically what it is. Again, it's pretty much just uh, sort of a fake back screen like this into an immediate flare for the back screener. So I'm also not even 100% sure that this is really the original Kansas action, and you might have some coaches that disagree with this being called Kansas action, but at least from my recollection, this kind of after timeout play where Trey right here, again, is setting this quick back pick for Capella, basically slipping out of it to come off this sort of, again, pinch screen, flare screen, whatever you want to call it, to that same corner is a Kansas action. So that part, again, not super common, but the beauty of this play is that this was all really a decoy to set up Trey driving at baseline. And now here's where the hammer screen takes place. Hammer screen, pretty much a flare screen, back screen to the corner to get a shooter a corner three as Capella, after coming off that back screen, is going to whip around after going towards the baseline. He's going to now turn around, face half court, as Bogdanovich walk, works his way up, makes it look like he's out of the play, and then right when his man Bertans falls asleep, Capella turns, sets a great screen on him. Trey delivers a great pass, drifting out of bounds to Bogdanovich in the corner for, again, this hammer screen, which is a huge, huge action to get threes end of games. Actually, origins from Darvin Ham, which you might not no, but again, as you watch this play all the way through, you see Trey hit, ball reversal, Kansas action, into a hammer for Bogdanovich. Perfect execution on the ATO by Nate McMillan and the Atlanta Hawks.